It's Jody with All About the Harvest, where I teach you how to grow, use, and preserve your harvest. And today I'm coming at you with another Azure Standard haul. So this time I have some new products as well, and I am going to explain what I paid for them. They had a big sale in the month of December. I'm gonna explain that in detail as well. If you're new to Azure or you don't know about Azure, I'll just briefly explain. It's a company that sells directly to you, so they cut out the middleman. And because they cut out the middleman, the products are less expensive. Now, they usually focus on organic and non-GMO and more natural type products, but they do have non-organic products as well. They have a variety of things from you know, kitchen products, to like cleaning products, to vitamins, to food, to canning jars and canning products. Uh, they have quite a variety of gardening things. So you really wanna check them out. I will put a link to them in the description below this video. And today we're gonna to talk a little bit more about some of these products, why I purchased them, and then the prices. In December of 2023, they had a special that they never ran before. And Azure doesn't only just sell Azure products, they sell products from other name brands. So in the month of December, Azure ran a special on products that were made by Azure. So Azure has a couple of their own brands. One, which is a new one, is called the Azure Canning Company. So they also have this, it's the Azure Clean, so that's their cleaning line of products. They have Azure Market, which is their food line of products. So of those, they ran specials. Now the one that wasn't included in this particular special was the Azure Clean, but all the other Azure products were included. And in the month of December, if you place an order that was over $150, then you would get 15% off of any Azure products that you ordered minus the Azure Clean products. So in the month of December, I took advantage of that. And these are the products that I ordered in the month of December. So I'm gonna go through them, tell you kind of how that worked, give you a little bit about the original price and then the sale price. And again, this is just something that you can take with you so that you know like, oh, they have these certain products. Maybe you didn't know of them. A lot of these are new products that I've never ordered from Azure before. So I like to give you a little bit about the products that I order. And then of course, I always tell you the price I pay so that you know what you can expect. Now, to get an Azure account, it is completely free. Azure is not network marketing. It's not an MLM. It is just a company that sells direct to consumer. To sign up for an account it is completely free. You don't even have to buy anything, but you can sign up for an account. And I highly recommend you do that because if you do, then you'll get emails like the email that I got in December saying, hey, we're doing this first time ever sale where we're gonna give you an additional 15% off of any of our Azure products. I knew about that because I got the email. So I highly suggest if you wanna get in on some of those specials and deals that you do sign up for an Azure account and that way then you'll be notified when and if they do that again. So again, I have the link for that in the description below so that you can check them out and sign up for yourself. Again, it's free. So let's talk about some of the things that I ordered in the month of December. And this is one of the first things I ordered. These are the Azure canning jars. Now I did do an in-depth video on Azure canning jars versus ball canning jars. And then I will link that up above. It'll be in the iCards of this video. And if you wanna check that out because I go more in detail on that, that'll be in the description below this video. I will cut to the chase and tell you, I think Azure canning jars are a high quality canning jar, and so I do recommend them. I still love ball canning jars as well, but if I can get Azure canning jars cheaper than or the same price of ball canning jars, then I will do that. And that's exactly what happened in the month of December. And to that point, certain canning jars are definitely less expensive for me in my area they're less expensive from Azure. There are certain ones that are not less expensive. So it just, it kind of depends on your area and what you need. Now for me, I particularly love their 
half gallon canning jars. And I love them because, well, a couple reasons. One, they're super high quality. Two, the price is better than I can get locally. So typically canning jars in my area, half gallon canning jars are, are currently, and in the last year, have been running for about $15.99 for a six pack. There are some times where it will go on sale and the six pack will be $13.99, but that is few and far between. Once a year, maybe twice, but I believe it's, it's been harder to get those sales definitely since COVID. And so I always look to get them on sale and, and I'm, I haven't been finding them as much on sale. So when Azure came out with the half gallon jars, I thought I would give them a try. And when I first bought these jars, when they came out uh, this fall, I got them and I paid $13.38 for a six pack of Azure canning jars. Now, one other thing Azure does with their canning jars, which I absolutely love, is they allow you to purchase them in, a, in the case with or without the rings and the lids. So if you purchase them without the rings and the lids, you will pay less. So when I paid $13.38, that was without the rings and the lids, okay? And that was a sale price at the time when I got them in uh, my September order. Well, I will say that this month in the month of January, because it is currently January 4th, in the month of January, these same jars the half price is $13.38, and it does not look like that is the sale price. It looks like that's the normal price. For me, that's a great price. Now, I have an excessive amount of rings, and I have a ton of lids, so I didn't need to pay the extra for the rings and the lids. If you get this with rings and the lids, you will pay a little bit more, and that goes for their other sizes as well, which are the quart jars and the pint jars currently. They may be coming out with other sizes in the future, but right now those are the three sizes that they have. So that is one of the reasons I love them. The other reason is because they come in these big jar, or these big boxes, excuse me, and the boxes have you know a cover on them so it's protected unlike the ball jars where they're just, um, they're just, you know, a plastic sheet over it. And so the other thing I like about these, and I showed it in uh, my, my other Ball versus Azure video, but just because I think it's so cool, they are in these boxes and they have a divider. So they offer a little bit more protection as well. So that is one of the things I love about these. So it's not just, you know, the half gallon jars, but it is the pints and the quarts as well. They're in these boxes with that divider in between. And then it's nice from a storage perspective, especially when you're not using those particular jars. Now for me, canning jars, specifically the half gallon size, you know, I, I only use these from a canning perspective for apple juice and grape juice because that is the only safe approved tested recipe that you can use in half gallon jars for canning. But I use these a lot for my dried goods. So I dehydrate a lot. Um, I will store my, my dried goods, like my dried beans or rice, different things like that in here. Powdered goods I will store in depending upon how much of, of them I have. So I use these a lot for dried goods and that is the majority of what, what I use these for. So all of that to say, there are many other benefits and of these jars and why I love them. And again, you can find out more in the Ball versus Azure canning jar video. So I'll let you watch that, but that was just kind of a, a high level. Now, here's what I paid for these. So these in the month of December, this was awesome. These were already on sale in the month of December. So they were on sale for $11.37 for a six pack of half gallon jars. So I bought two more boxes of these half gallon jars at $11.37 each. But then on top of that, I got a 15% off because remember I bought over $150 and then anything that was Azure minus the Azure Clean, I got 15% off. So for a six pack of these jars in the month of December, I paid $9.66 each, which is awesome. That is like pre COVID prices. So that was really awesome. I'm in love with these jars. They are definitely high quality. 
and I will be showing you in another video how I put my dried beans and different things in here and how I seal them. So if you want to be notified when that video comes out, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and then hit that bell button. The bell button will send you notifications when that comes out. So that way then you can watch that video when it comes out. And if it comes out by the time that you're watching this, then I will have it linked above and below in the description. Uh, but check that out. I'm gonna be actually recording that today after I'm done recording this. And then whenever I get to editing that, I'll get it out for you. Okay, so that was the Azure canning jars. Great price, $9.66. I'm almost kicking myself for not getting more. Okay, so the next thing that I ordered was this beef gelatin, okay? And so this is unflavored 100% beef gelatin. This is a one pound bag. And I did uh, print out some stuff on their from their website on a couple of these products just to give you a little bit more information. I'll put it on the screen here so you can see it. But this is what it says about the beef gelatin. It says Azure Market Beef Gelatin is a fantastic protein rich addition to aerated foods, lending them a smooth, creamy texture. It's especially good in milk based desserts, thickened cream and low fat spreads, or aerated desserts like mousses, marshmallows, icings, frostings, toppings, chiffons, and souffles. And of course, it's perfect for jello. I will say that they did say there was a lot of reviews said it was amazing for jello. You can also add it to soups and smoothies as a protein supplement or even stir a little into your morning coffee or tea. I'm definitely gonna be doing that, adding it to my coffee. And obviously I could add it to smoothies as well, which I would do. I'm happy with the protein part of it. So uh, this has six grams of protein per tablespoon, so per serving, and a serving is one tablespoon. It says, our beef gelatin is produced from grass and grain-fed cattle and contains no artificial colors, flavors, or sweeteners, no preservatives, no hydrogenated oils, no modified starches or gums, and no refined sugars. Absolutely nothing but natural beef gelatin. So that is why I got this. I wanted to try it. Um, I've been you know, reading a little bit about getting some more protein in my diet, and this is one of the ways that I thought I would do that. Also, it's good for other things as well. So this was one of the products that I got, and this particular product, so let's, let me look at my price list here. So this particular product was $14.63, normally that is was the normal price and then remember i got that 15 percent off so that brought it down to twelve dollars and 44 cents now the next thing i got was the azure market organic flaxseed oil and that is this and so flaxseed is really high in omega-3s which a lot of us need and this has like a nutty flavor so I will be adding it to like salad dressings and some other things as well. Uh, this is organic and it is fresh cold pressed. It does say that, you know, after you open it, you should be putting it in the fridge. I know with flaxseed in general, it just helps it to last longer, even like with flax seeds or ground flaxseed. It helps it to stay better longer if you have it in the refrigerator. It says wholesome, natural, and fresh. This organic flaxseed is pure, unrefined, unadulterated, and cold press. Nothing is added. It is a terrific source of plant-based omega-3 fatty acids since flaxseed naturally contains more omega-3s than any other seed or nut. Excellent with cottage cheese, used in salad dressings or drizzled on popcorn. And it says keep refrigerated. And so I thought I would try that out. Now this is 16 ounces. And for that 16 ounce bottle of the organic flaxseed oil, that was $8.89. Now I remember I got the 15% off. So I paid $7.56. Okay, the next thing is something I've used before, but not from Azure. And this is vegetable glycerin. So this is a non-GMO food grade vegetable glycerin. 
And so what do you use this for? So you can use this in tinctures. That's how I will be using it. So you use it in place of alcohol in tinctures. So that way you can make a tincture with the glycerin instead of the alcohol. And that way somebody that is sensitive to alcohol, whether that's a child or like an alcoholic that um, is recovering and does not want to be drinking any alcohol, then they can get the same properties from that which would be a tincture is it would now be called a glycerite because you're using the vegetable glycerin and it is non-gmo and it's food grade so that's what you need and it can be quite expensive but i found that they have a pretty good price so for this one gallon jug of non-gmo food grade vegetable glycerin it was 31 dollars 97 but because i got that additional 15 percent off i paid 27 dollars 17 which was perfect the next thing on my list that I got was wild rice. So again, this was from Azure and it was non-GMO wild rice. So this is a two pound package of wild rice and I thought the price was good. It was even better once I had the additional 15% off, but for two pounds of the wild rice, it was $17.10. And with that 15% off, I paid $14.54 and I felt like that was a great price for wild rice. Then I got the Azure Clean. So this is this was the one product that I got that wasn't 15% off. I didn't realize that the Azure Clean products weren't 15% off, but regardless, um, I ended up getting it and I'm happy with it. So this is Azure Clean dish soap. It's fragrance free. Azure's uh, Cleaning products are very natural, but yet effective. And for that 32 ounce bottle, it was $6.92. And again, I did not get any additional savings on that because it was part of the Azure Clean. Now they do have things like, you know, laundry soap and all sorts of other cleaners as well, but I wanted to try this out because I haven't tried any of their cleaners yet. And I thought I would give this a try. I personally use fragrance free, more natural dish soaps that are also um, color free. So I thought this would be right up the alley for me and I wanted to give it a try. So that's what I did. Now, the next thing I got was Azure Market Organics Canola Oil Expeller Pressed Organic. So this is a 32 ounce bottle of organic canola oil one of the reasons I got this is because it has a high smoke point. So we typically use olive oil, but that doesn't have a high smoke point. So if you wanna fry or saute something, you don't wanna use olive oil because olive oil doesn't have a high smoke point. And so I wanted to get some organic canola oil just for those times where I needed to use something like that. Also because canola oil doesn't have um, a strong flavor. We do have avocado oil as well that we use, but this is more of like a mild flavor. So I just wanted to give it a try. Again, being organic, expeller pressed uh, canola oil, I wanted to give that a try. And because it was from Azure Market, I was able to get an additional 15% off. So for that 32 ounce bottle, normally uh, in the month of December, I would have paid $5.73. But because it was 15% off, I paid $4.87 for that particular 32 ounce bottle, which I thought was a great price, especially for organic. I looked in the month of January just today, and the price for that was now $5.42 as a regular price. So sometimes their prices can fluctuate based on various things. So I just wanted to let you know that. The next thing I got was from Azure Markets and it was some Bing natural cherries and they're dehydrated cherries and it was one pound. Again, they're non-GMO. And the nice thing about this is it doesn't have any additional sugar added to it and it doesn't, it's not made with any uh, sulfur preservatives. So a lot of times dried fruits, if you didn't know, they will put in a sulfur preservative. And if you have a sulfur allergy or sulfur sensitivity, you can get headaches from that or you can have some sort of a, a reaction to that. So I like that this didn't have any sulfur, also didn't have any additional sugar in it. And 
This was again, one pound non GMO. And the price of that was $12 and 40 cents. But I paid only $10 and 54 cents because I got that 15% off. Okay, then I got Azure Market celery seeds and I got a one pound bag. Now this is a really big bag of celery seed given that if you tip when you typically buy celery seed it's like in a little, you know, little jar. And this year in in 2023 I got like 80 to 100 pounds of cucumbers. I was given them. And so I pickled a lot of things. I made a lot of recipes and I like went out of my celery seed. So because I used all of that celery seed up when I got all those cucumbers, I thought, you know what, I'm going to get some celery seed and you know, I can get it in bulk. Again, I well, once I open this, I will store this like in a glass container again. If you want to know how I do that, subscribe because you can see how I do that. Uh, in the video that will be coming up. And I do have some videos on how to do that as well. Um, but this is a one pound pack and it is GMO free. And these are whole celery seeds. So I figured I will be set for quite a while with these celery seeds. Now, again, if you're wanting to keep something long-term, there are multiple options on how to do that. Uh, one of which is I will store in glass jars, but if it's longer term, you can store it in Mylar bags. And I do have a video on that. So I'll link that up above and then I'll also link that in the description below. So you can kind of check that out if you're wondering, you know, about storing things in Mylar bags. As far as storing things in glass jars, uh, I do have some videos on that as well and I can link those in the description as well. So the price of this normally was $6.35 for this one pound bag. What I paid for it was $5.40 because I got it at that 15% off. So I think that was a great price. I mean, that's probably about what you're gonna pay for a little four ounce jar at the grocery store, probably three or three to five dollars for that. And I got a whole pound of it. So I will be set. Obviously you use celery seed for more than just pickling. Um, you, know, you can use it in coleslaw and different vinegars and like dill dip and things like that. Obviously you can make your own celery salt with it by grinding it up. And so there's just different things like that. But um, that's what I got that for. And the next thing I got was a five pound bag of black eyed peas. So this right here is the five pound bag of black eyed peas. And I have never had dried black eyed peas before. The reason I got that five pound bag was because I am looking at canning the 10 bean soup recipe from Ball in the Ball Blue Book. And in that particular uh, recipe, it calls for black eyed peas. And so I needed to get the black eyed peas so I could actually make that. So over the course of the last year, I've been buying additional dried beans from Azure and I had everything I needed except the black eyed peas. So I got the black eyed peas and for a five pound bag, that was $14 and four cents. But because again, I had that 15% off coupon, I paid $11.93 for five pounds, which I think was a great deal. Now, I wanna say that 15% off coupon was for anyone. So it wasn't like just me or just new people, that was for anyone. So uh, again, if you sign up for an account with them, you'll get the notifications. Uh, that was the first time they did that particular coupon, but sometimes they will do coupons for other things, okay? Um, and I did take a little bit of information about black eyed peas from their website, because specifically I thought, you know what, if, if you haven't used black eyed peas, why would you want them? And so I'm gonna just read to you some of the things that they say about it. Our Azure family loves these beans because in addition to their high protein content, they're a great source of thiamine, which is vitamin B1, iron, phosphorus, magnesium, and zinc. They're also exceptionally high in copper and folate, which is vitamin B9. One cup of cooked beans provides 50% of your daily value for copper and a whopping 88% for folate. Now these beans are thinner skinned than most beans, which means that they cook more quickly and do not need to be pre-soaked. 
So again, that's just a few things about the Black Eyed Peas. So later today, after I finish this video, I am going to be doing another video where I am vacuum sealing these in my half gallon mason jars and kind of showing you a couple different ways that you can do that. I have um, one video showing you how to do that with the Food Saver vacuum sealer, um, not these beans, but other things. And again, those are linked in the, in the description below, but I will be doing it with a new product, a, um, a cordless vacuum sealer that I think that you'll find to be quite beneficial because there's no cord and it's pretty simple and it's specifically just for mason jars. So I'll be creating a video on that next. Again, subscribe and hit the notification button. That way you can get notified when that comes out. So the next thing I got was Azure Market Organic Coconut Powder and it is coconut milk powder. It's one pound, again, it's organic. And let me just tell you a little bit about this particular product. I grabbed it again from their website. It says Azure Market Organics Coconut Milk Powder makes a deliciously creamy non-dairy creamer for coffee, tea, and other beverages. Our coconut milk is made with hand harvested coconuts from small plantations, then gently dehydrated to ensure the coconut's potent nutrients remain intact. Enjoy in a smoothie, coffee, or latte for a healthy, creamy dairy alternative. Coconut milk is also great in recipes like curries and soups or poured over cereal or oatmeal. You can even use it to make dairy-free whipped cream, yogurt, or ice cream. I thought this would be great to use as a, a milk alternative and also for some of these other reasons that they said in here. So this is just something a little bit different, something new. I'm looking forward to using that. So the price of this was $9.62 and I paid $8.18 for that one pound of organic coconut milk powder. Now the other thing that you do get in your order is a flyer. So uh, I got this order in December and then I got the January sales flyer. So it is a printout of their sales, but also um, they talk about products, specifically new products, but they also have like different articles in here. So for this month, they have the new year, new pantry, and they're giving you tips on pantry things, storage and, and different parts of it, tools, whatever. So this is kind of neat to look at when you do get it in. And also it's a quick reference all in one spot of where your sales are, what products will be on sale in the month of January. Now, that being said, you can find all of this information online as well. So, you know, it's just like in a different format, but you can find all that information online as well. I personally am a person that likes paper copies. I like to look at things. So this was my order for December. Again, I got that 15% off with that coupon code that's no longer available, but I just wanted to show you what I got. Also some things that you might be interested in. I am ordering in the month of January as well. So I will be creating a video for that. If you like these videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell so that you can be notified when I do my next one. And also so that you can be notified when my video on how to vacuum seal these with a handheld cordless vacuum sealer. Also, if you have any Azure questions, feel free to put them in the comments below and I'll be sure to follow up with you. And until next time, happy shopping.